Hey everyone, Kita Sean here, so welcome back to another episode of Kita News, where we talk about everything otaku. We got a bunch of anime news that was announced this past weekend, so let's get right to it. Upcoming anime film Estebo Live Great Escape revealed that the film will release in 2023. A new trailer was also released focusing on the main character, Kisaragi. Upcoming TV anime Smile of Arstonoria, the animation released a new visual and trailer and revealed additional cast members. Chihara Minoi will play Liddell, Yukana will play Soto, Inoue Manina will play Hamet, Tomari Asuna will play Perdera, Hanamori Yumiri will play Voini, and Matsuda Reina and Matsuda Satsumi will play Seide. Troika and DM Pictures released a new trailer and visual for the upcoming original anime series Shinobi no Itoki. Additional cast members were also revealed. Yuki Aoi will play Kisegawa Kirei, Sekine Hitomi will play Sukuno Ryoko, and Tomita Miu will play Tsubaki Satomi. The official website for Idol Busho has revealed new cast members. Kondo Reina will play Honma Mashiro. The members of Cider will include Yoshitake Chihaya who will play Ichika, Yamara Misuzu who will play Nina, Yoshiki Haruka will play Mina, Ohara Wakana will play Shiori, and Yamamoto Maki will play Isuzu. Shogakkan has revealed that Yamamoto Nao's Kin no Kuni Mizu no Kuni manga will be getting an anime film and it will release next spring. Shogakkan also announced in their monthly cheese magazine that Mino Nozomi's Yakuza Lover manga will be getting a live action TV series. Utaki chan wa Asobitai second season's first trailer and visual were revealed and it is set to air fall 2022. Science Saru TV anime revealed a new trailer and cast members. Kawakatsumira will play Barry, Nagase Anna will play Hack. Iri no Miu will play Finn, Sato Setsuji will play Hank, Sadoka Sayuri will play Madame 44, Kugimi Arie will play Smiley, and a mystery voice actor will be playing Mr. Watson. Side Games and PA Works announced that they will be producing an original TV anime called Akiba Made War, Akiba Made Senso. Kondo Reina will play Kazuhira Nagomi who wants to be a maid, and Sato Rina will play Kazutoshi Ranko who is a retired maid. I'm actually kind of excited for this one, so... Yeah, this is definitely on my watch list. Extreme Hearts Anime revealed that Hashimoto Chinami will play QON and 4 cx Nono Robot? I, I don't know. The final episode of Data Live Season 4 announced that Season 5 is currently in development. The final episode of Kaguya-sama Love is War announced that a new anime is currently in the works. Voice actress Uchiyama Yunina goes on hiatus due to poor health. Hope she recovers soon. Voice actors Kajiyuki and Takitatsu Ayana announced that the two of them are expecting their first child. Congratulations to the both of them. The Love Life Sunshine Fantasy spinoff Genjitsu no Yahane Sunshine in the Mirror will be getting a TV anime and it will air in 2023. Shogakkan Big Comic Spirits magazine revealed that Utoto's Chi Chikuyu no Undo ni Tsuite will be getting an anime adaptation. During the Melty Blood Type Lumina official tournament this past weekend, it was revealed that four new DLC characters will be releasing later this year. Two characters for the summer and two characters this upcoming winter. I'll be releasing a video pretty soon about my speculations on these DLC characters. Nihon Falcom revealed concept art that teases the next Yeast game. The attack of the characters are performing an X shape. So I'm assuming this is Yeast 10. Ijinanaide Nagatoro-san, Don't Toy With Me, Miss Nagatoro has announced that a second season will be airing in January 2023. Super excited for this one. The Tale of Outcast, Nokemono Tachi no Yoru, announced that a TV anime adaptation has been confirmed. Karukawa announced that Fushimi Tsukasa's and Kanzaki Hiro's Edo Manga Sensei will be ending with its 13th volume, which will release August 10th. Crunchyroll and Toei Animation announced that the Knights of the Zodiac Saint Seiya CG anime will be getting a second season and it will air this month? If I'm not mistaken, this first season was a Netflix exclusive and I heard it didn't do too well, so I'm a little bit confused on what happened here. Robotic Note celebrates its 10th anniversary with a brand new visual with characters at the beach. Congratulations for 10 years. Crunchyroll also announced that that time I got reincarnated as a Slime Scarlet Bond movie will be releasing early 2023 globally. This is super exciting. I'm a huge Slime fan. I'm pretty sure there are a bunch of Slime fans out there. We get to see this movie here in the States. That's awesome. Can't wait for that. I still need to pick up this anime, but Birdie Wing is getting a second season and it's going to be airing in 2023. Now the last piece of news, and it's a big one too, Sega is exploring potential live action TV and movie adaptations for games developed by Atlas with various studios and producers. 
During an interview with IGN, Sega's head of entertainment production film and TV, Nakahara Toru, said that Atlas worlds are filled with high drama, cutting edge style, and compelling characters. Stories like those from Persona franchise really resonate with our fans, and we see an opportunity to expand the lore like no one has ever seen before. So yeah, a potential Persona of live action might be coming. It's going to be an interesting one. I think they're just on this, this hype train right now because of how good Sonic is doing in uh, theaters so yeah I, I can see why they want to keep making movies now but um, hey you never know it could be good but at the same time you know it's video game live action so it's not always the greatest but there you guys have it that's all the news that we have for the week uh, if you guys are watching this I'm most likely gonna be at anime expo so uh, there's probably not gonna be any uh, Kita news episodes coming out um, next Tuesday. If I do get it up on Tuesday, awesome. If not, uh, I do have another video, uh, you know, ready to upload that day. But uh, the next Kita News video will most likely be next Friday. But anyways, thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys in the next one. Let us.